The Honorable Philip J. Pierre-led administration is making a life-changing investment in the local football community. For the first time, aspiring footballers are getting paid to play the beautiful game. What's happening this morning is good news, very good news. And I feel proud in that in my first budget address, I allocated a million dollars towards the same professional football league in my first budget address. Prime Minister Pierre's leadership has inspired the introduction of the historic semi-professional football league in St. Lucia. Our nation's youth and aspiring footballers will gain access to new opportunities to develop their skills and talents and get a legitimate shot at going pro. We are here today to historically and symbolically provide finances, compensation, payment to footballers in this great nation. This is what we are here to do today and I think the affiliates, the coaches and I think every member must acknowledge that this government has done the unprecedented step, taken the unprecedented step of seeing that our footballers, because of the effort and commitment, deserve compensation on a monthly basis. I think that is... The government is investing more than $1 million to support the Semi-Pro Football League. The Semi-Pro Football League season spans seven months. Each Tier 1 team can earn up to $13,190 monthly during the season. St. Lucia's first semi-professional football league will strengthen the local economy by creating new business linkages and employment opportunities in coaching, team management, media and broadcasting, and playing field maintenance. It is said, and listen carefully, the professionalization of football brings stru structure, discipline, and a pathway for aspiring players to reach their full potential. The Semi-Professional Football League was officially launched in January. Semi-Pro Football League matches kicked off in March, and the payment of salaries and training allowances to players commenced in May. The Semi-Professional Football League is a collaboration between the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports and the St. Lucia Football Association. Office of the Prime Minister.